Well, hello and welcome to I Love Gay Today. And we are in Los Angeles and we're exploring kind of the, the melding of two worlds, art and filmmaking. And we're with Sean and Martin. How are you guys? Hi. Doing good. Oh, fantastic. Good. Sean, it's good to reconnect with you. I haven't seen you since, like you said, when you were at the, we saw each other twice, I think, uh, at that Hornet party in, uh, in New York, which was about two years ago. Yeah, yeah, definitely. That was like one of my times traveling there and uh, it was just, uh, Really nice networking event. Yeah, and we were together in LA over coffee, and uh, no, and I've gotten to know you through uh, some of the work you do, and uh, loved loved the uh, the film that uh, that that you uh, that you had sent over, and it's a uh, it's a it's a wonderful film that kind of touches on the entire world of Martin and his uh, in his world of art. So what we'll do is. So what we'll do is before we uh, get started with this, what I'll do is uh, we'll we'll show a, a, a nice uh, quick excerpt of it so it gives everybody a chance to be on the same page. Passion, for me, is powerful and full of vibrant colors. It can be sensitive and yet full of emotion. Tragedy does not play a role in my work. I long for the emotional impulse of something that longs to be heard in each of us. That was that was wonderful. It was amazing. And so, uh, uh, for Sean, what was your uh, what was your motivation for you know seeing seeing that and putting all that together? Well, we actually we met. Um, it, during Art Basel in Miami, and we had decided that we wanted to work on a project that had something to do with art, um, something that we're both inspired by. You know, we basically got, like, we're just brainstorming ideas, and um, we just wanted to get something, you know, break the ice, get something out. Yeah. Um, so we just shot that, and we have plenty more things we actually are planning to shoot, but um, it's still in the works, but. <laughs> so that was a good start to, uh, to uh, a future of being able to uh, really kind of explore and delve into some of, uh, uh, some of what goes on inside of Martin's head. Yes. Yes. <laughs> and Martin, yes. I was, yeah, what was, uh, what was your, I mean, I was gonna say what was your story, but uh, you're very, uh, uh, so much came out in the, that video that you put together. And so, but you're from, uh, you're from Slovakia, yes? Yes. Yes. So I was born in former Czechoslovakia, so now Slovakia, and then um, almost like five to Los Angeles. And I studied art basically the entire time, like, you know, since the age of 15, um, restoration, and then later on I studied art history. And, you know, when I came here, I decided that I'll be, you know, I'll be doing art and painting full time from my studio and to establish myself and my career, like being a visual artist full time, plus the second job that I would have is kind of traveling the world and collecting the inspiration. And when I met Sean, uh, when we met in Miami, I was like, oh, what do you do? Yeah. And what do you, you do? And then, you know, we just decided that it would be a good idea to do a little project, something like short um, video documentary about an artist. And I haven't done anything like it before. Um, it's mostly, you know, like sharing work and everything else on, through social media. And then, you know, when you have the opening at the gallery, which is in my case in Palm Springs, um, that's different. So I didn't really let anyone inside my studio because I consider it to be 
private space, but at the same time, I don't really, you know, we are being kind of isolated. So doing this whole lockdown thing, I was kind of, for me, it was nothing really different because I was still, you know, confined in my studio slash home at the same time. And yeah, that was a really fun project to do. And, you know, I was just looking at, looking over it um, multiple times and, you know, and just looking at it, we were thinking, oh, we should do something different or something longer or shorter. Um, so yeah, there are multiple ideas um, that we are thinking about. And um, I can say that it's really exciting to yeah. see it afterwards once it's done. No, that's, that's exciting and it's wonderful. And it's great that the, you know, I love Art Basel, Basel or Basel. I never know exactly how to say that correctly. <laughs> But I love that too. I think it's a Basel. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> but it's just uh, because, uh, like you said, because social media kind of helps to communicate a lot of what we think and what we're, you know, in your case, what you think and what you're able to create. And you could go only so far, but really working with Sean, delving into the whole world of filmmaking, it kind of gives you an entire, not only an entire new audience, but also probably in some ways is more in depth than how it tells your story. And, uh, Hopefully, you'll be able to, you know, film festivals and others will be able to uh, uh, introduce your shorts to, to their audience as well. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Um, and we're just planning on doing a lot of experimental stuff. Like, we don't really want to put, like, uh, you know, any specific labels on it. We're just going to be really creative and, uh, and I just... Well, you guys. Uh, hopefully, we'll show you guys soon. <laughs> yeah, no, you guys put out a great message, and I think especially during this time, you know, people are looking for uh, 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 not just not just hope and inspiration, but positivity, and I think that came out a lot of what you guys are doing as well. So no, it's uh, and and what we're going to do is also uh, in this video, uh, in in the video that we upload here, we're going to also make sure that there's a link to the Vimeo, which is the full link, because we're only showing kind of excerpts uh, uh, of what you had but we're going to have the whole length video. So people really be able to, to get a full chance to, to, to see the, the work you guys have created. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. And I would also definitely recommend other artists to, you know, connect with Sean and talking about their ideas and, you know, um, through the lens of his camera and his vision as, um, as a director and delivering that certain message to the audience and just show the variety of um of people artists and their work because there's there's so much talent in in los angeles and it definitely deserves a spotlight especially like collaborating with someone who's young who's studying at the same time and you know it's it's his business so i think that i as musicians or you know with multitude of talents to you know approach Sean and do some do something creative together because every single time when you do something with other artists um you know the the results are always different and you know it's also a learning process so I would definitely encourage everyone if someone is watching if there's another artist I would definitely encourage encourage them to contact Sean and discuss their idea <laughs> don't you love that yeah, Sean I <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. And I mean, I actually, I think it's really good for, for really any business right now. Um, even web designers, like, you know, anyone that needs a way to like show people who they are, like, you can't go out and meet everybody today. And it's kind of a good way to get to know somebody without actually even meeting them in person and just get a feel for it and yeah. develop a level of trust with you know, your clients, um, you know, prior to working on a project. Yeah. Well, I'll make sure that uh, in everything here that they'll also be able to find you very easily and have a link to all your social profiles and, and, and so forth. So, no, very much. Uh, I was really glad that you guys were able to join us for a few moments and kind of share your story and share your vision and, and all that with our, with our audience in the world here. Thank you. Thank you. Well, fantastic. <laughs> well, thanks for being here. Thank you for having us.